One of the, the foundation pieces of the course is really looking at the notion of dialogue. Not just the theory of dialogue, but what is it, does it mean to be a dialogic leader? And how do you bring dialogue into situations where there's conflict, where there's a need to make collaborative decisions, where there's a need for groups of people to learn about a particular issue and, and have a shared understanding of that issue. In terms of core content, really we start with the students that come to the program. We start with their personal biographies. What is it that they do and what do they want to do to create more dialogue and, and greater engagement around public issues or community issues. We look at some of the core concepts, uh, the sensibilities and the, the key practices of an engagement practitioner. Uh, we do that through active learning exercises and examination of some of the core theory as well as look at how that applies to the work that students bring into the program with them. The sensibilities of a dialogue and engagement practitioner really begin with listening. So if you are able to listen, not just to the words that people have to say, you know, their problems or their issues, but really what, what their values are. This is a, a kind of a deep listening that we teach in the program that is really fundamental. When you start to listen to people uh, deeply, when you don't rush in with your own views and you're willing to suspend your certainty about a situation and really hear people out, you find that incredible magical things do happen and potential for collaboration or cooperation or new understanding is there in places where it hadn't been before. So in that sense, I think um, the learning about how dialogue really works is something that can bring value to all parts of our lives. Thank you.